Rembrandt Communications helps you boost sales, awareness, and credibility fast with a unique combination of SEO, copywriting, content marketing strategy, and public relations. Visit RembrandtWrites.com for your free initial consultation today. Welcome back to Simplify Your Small Business. David Wolf here with Melanie Rembrandt. As always, good morning to you. Good morning, David. How are you today? Doing well, thank you. And uh, continuing my journey with you, simplifying and for our audience, serving our audience, in just a few minutes, we'll give you some tips on how you can simplify your business and your life. Uh, in this uh, session, why your blog doesn't work and how to fix it. <laughs> All right. So uh, I'll dive in here. Number one, <laughs> are you sitting down? It's boring. Yeah, I hate to tell you, but you might want to read your blog. I mean, we've both read blogs and information out there that are just not that interesting or unique. So just give you a little bit of tough love here. You don't want to waste time and effort. And your audience is bombarded with all kinds of messages all day long. So you have to be different and you have to give your audience something interesting that they want to read. Um, in fact, I mean, you should check to see if people are even reading the content you're putting out there. If not, um, maybe they don't read blogs. Maybe you look, need to look at a different medium like you yeah. know, creating a video or an infographic or something else. But yeah. um, that's, you really need to see how interesting your blogs really are. No, it's a great. Yeah, there's a lot baked into what you've just said. And we, uh, you should listen to our archives, folks, if, if you're listening to this, because we've referred some of this thinking has been uh, reflected in uh, other episodes of Simplify. Number two, not only is it boring, but number two is it's poorly written. So uh, this is about <laughs> language and about, I don't know, you're, you're a copywriter. So take us down this path here. Right. I mean, there are a lot of services out there now that provide free content or very inexpensive content, maybe for $5, you Aye. can get a blog written. And trust me, it is sound. it sounds too good to be true. And it is. I mean, if you seriously want to improve your sales, your credibility, your online awareness with a blog, you need to work with someone who is an experienced writer who knows how to provide value, interesting content, and also kind of sell your products and services at the same time. Yeah. And by doing that, you're going to realize that more people are reading your blog. You can use it in, in various ways, and the expense pays for itself. Well, and I love this idea of quality. Again, it has to do with the depth and thoughtfulness with which you express yourself. And if it looks like it's not thoroughly thought through and the writing isn't really adding value, I guess that's the, the key here. Uh, it's just not going to move people. It's not going to move the needle for you. Exactly. And, and one other thing, too. Blogs are a great way to get noticed by the search engines. So your copywriter should know how to optimize your blog. Otherwise, you're missing a huge opportunity to get more awareness online. You want to work with somebody like you, Melanie, right? I don't mean to blow the smoke, but, <laughs> but I mean, you want to work with someone who understands this delicate balance with keyword optimization and actually having it substantive, right? Yeah, basically, if you're going to spend the time and effort to do a regular blog, do it the right way so it actually has some kind of effect, a positive effect on your business. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. Um, and you get what you pay for. So hire, hire somebody that's, if you need help writing, uh, work with them on an editorial schedule that makes sense for you and the content you want to be uh, creating and then, and then just make it really well written and qualitatively uh, adding value in every way. And finally, you have no plan. So if you have no plan, you're not going to accomplish much, right? <laughs> Right. And it it goes into what you just mentioned. You want to figure out your, your calendar. What do you want to write about? What do your customers and potential customers care about? You want a specific blog goal with a, a specific deadline and topic. Yeah. And then, you know, particular SEO keyword terms you want to use. And, and what do you want people to do after they read your blog? What is your call to action? And, you know, as we said before, you want to track all that. Uh, that way you can actually see if your blog is making a difference and doing what you actually want it to do. Yep. Love it. Love it. Love it. All right. So those are the three points for today. Let's quickly review. Uh, I'll take the first one. Why your blog doesn't work and how to fix it. Number one, it's really boring. Yawn. <laughs> Number two, it is poorly written. 
Okay, make sure the writing is there. It's quality. It's your voice. You want to stand out and you you want it to represent you as a thought leader and finally you have no plan in terms of your content generation yes focus on what you want to accomplish and then test it to see if it's working so simple so elegant melanie rembrandt rembrandtwrites.com i am david wolf podcast and radio networks we'll see you next time on simplify your small business thanks melanie thanks david thanks everyone have a great day Podcast and Radio Networks produces and distributes podcasts and audiobooks for authors, speakers, entrepreneurs, and business leaders. If you're an existing podcaster, find out about our unique Grow Your Podcast distribution program to help you grow, connect, engage, and transact with your audience. Learn more at podcastandradio.com.